kind of got away from you? Um, I think we was just uh, a little bit late on our rotations on closing out to the three um, to some of the players that can shoot the ball. Um, but overall, I think that, you know, we played with a lot more force than we did in game one. Um, I mean, at the same time, they came out and was hitting, still hitting some tough shots. So we just got to get back to the drawing board and just come up with a different plan to, you know, make some adjustments. Anything in particular that you think you guys have to do going into game three? Um, start the game off how we started off with just physicality. Um, we know the game was being called a little tight tonight. Um, so it was a lot of early fouls early for some of our guys. Um, but at the same time, I just felt like, you know, we played with a lot more sense of urgency throughout the game. Um, but we just didn't put it, put together 48 minutes. Ready to go off of that. What did you think just about the, the frequency of the foul calls tonight and the way that impacted kind of the pace and the availability of guys in the rotation? Um, yeah, uh, you know, that was one of our goals to be able to come out, you know, be physical. But, you know, uh, the game was called tight. Um, you know, uh, JB, Doe got fouls early. Um, those two of our main guys that's out there in the unit with us. Um, but everybody off the bench, they came in, you know, try to give what they can to be able to help the starters out. Uh, but, I mean, at the same time, we just got to go back to the drawing board and just, you know, try to play without fouling. Um, stop sending them to the free throw line and, you know, just try to put together 48. Reggie, what can you do to try to keep Chris Paul and, and, and Devin Booker from getting cooking like they did in the second half? You just got to keep wearing them down. Um, they're two guys that, you know, does a lot for their team. Um, and we have guys that definitely can guard these guys. Um, but, I mean, it's just going to take a team effort to be able to contain them. Um, and, you know, they got going in the fourth quarter to make some tough shots. Uh, and, you know, I think that's where the separation of the game went. As, as a team, their shooting has just been off the charts, both the first three quarters on Monday night and ball night tonight. On Monday night, the discussion was about communication being part of the issue for you guys defensively. Is there something you can point to tonight that allowed them to get the looks that they got? Um, it just come down to, you know, just being able to guard your man one-on-one -on -one, um, and just, you know, playing with, you know, a, a force to, you know, try not to get scored on. Um, I just felt like um, at times, you know, we let our guard down a little bit on the defensive end, um, and they was just able to, you know, knock down some shots. Thanks, Greg. Yeah, yeah.